and welcome to my second Java beginner programming tutorial. I'm SciGuy1121 and let's go ahead and get started. As you can see, I have opened up the Eclipse program, which you downloaded in the last video, um, in my last tutorial. And you should pretty much see this blank screen. What you want to do is first go to File, New, and then Java Project and this screen should pop up. It may look a little bit different depending on which version of Eclipse you're using though. Um, in the project name, just type in your project name. I'm going to do mine tutorial. Then this stuff you don't need to worry about. Just hit finish and here we are. It's still blank as you can see, um, uh, except for it added this little tutorial folder in our package explorer. What you want to do is hit this button, and in the name, just type in something like um, test1, and then finish. And in here, you can see that we have um, test1.java that appeared, and you can see all we have is this public class test1 and then these little curly braces. Now you don't really need to worry about what this is for right now except to know that this is a class. And a class is pretty much a what, what defines an object. And in a class you have methods like if we type um, public void and you don't need to worry about what this means right now just uh, follow along with me so we have public void and then your method name like test method just make some parentheses and then a curly braces and this is what's called a method and a method is something in a class that contains instructions for the program to run and uh, the instructions you put in are the actual code the executed code which makes your program do whatever you want it to um so one more thing that you need to know for this um episode this tutorial is you always need to have a method called main in your program. And what happens is the computer, after it compiles all the code, it goes to this main method. If it doesn't have a main method, it won't run. So to make a main method, you go public static void. And you don't need to worry about what this means right now. I'll go over it later. And then main, be sure to capitalize main, put parentheses and put string capitalize string, args, and then square brackets, and then just curly braces at the end. And so this is how you declare a main class. So when you run the program, you have to have a main class, otherwise it won't run because it doesn't know where to start. And finally, just in Eclipse, if you want to run a project, um, hit this run button up here select Java application and for some reason it's doing that. I'll figure out what that was later but um, for now that's this video. Don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next